Well, I'll just kick things off. Uh, my name is Basil Sagos, the DEC Commissioner, um, here with uh, Department of State as well as uh, county and city officials to announce a really important milestone that we've made here, uh, talking about water quality here on Owasco Lake. Uh, we've been working for years on what's called a nine element plan, which is basically a, uh, an advanced watershed plan to look at the sources of, of phosphorus loading inside the lake. This is a large watershed, lots of uh, different inputs of, of pollution. And it was really important for us before we begin making uh, further advancements and further investments to understand exactly what the, uh, the sources of pollution uh, were. Uh, so we've, we've, we've done that. Now that, that is very much underway. Um, while sparing no expense on the investments we knew we needed to make over the years. So almost $10 million of investments just on HABs control. All of this is about uh, reducing the prevalence of harmful algal blooms. Uh, folks that are here in Wasco Lake and in the area here know very much about that problem. Uh, typically during the summer you see these, these heat waves come through, um, precipitation triggers a, a, a bloom on, on the lake and have a, can have a major impact on water quality. So what we're trying to do obviously is working with the local partners, strong local partners, uh, to bring the best science to bear and ultimately have the science drive the solutions long term. So that's what the Watershed Action Plan is all about. We're really excited to have this incredible partnership, uh, which I think reflects the right way of doing business, which is uh, state and local uh, uh, investment, state and local science, state and local uh, investments and policy. Um, 